Eh, mimi ni Guyo Denge Jarso. Mimi nafuga area hii ya Marsabit. Hapa mifugo ndio maisha yetu. Lakini nja ndio inamaliza mifugo yetu saa zingine. Tukiwa na chakula, mifugo watakuwa wengi. Livestock production is a major contributor to the Kenyan economy, accounting for more than 12% of the gross domestic product and a significant source of employment. About 60% of Kenya's livestock herd is found in the arid and semi-arid lands which constitute over 70% of the country. The key challenge here is drought. Kenya is exposed to severe drought which strikes about every three to five years, increasing in intensity with climate change. Between 2008 and 2011, the Kenyan economy lost an estimated 12.1 billion US dollars. The livestock sector accounted for 72% of the loss and as a result, livelihoods were grossly affected. Cassandre Leruso, a 38-year-old pastoralist from Nandodo sublocation in Isiolo County, knows only too well how much damage and instability is caused by drought. The recent 2016-2017 drought that severely depleted pasture in the rangelands across the Horn of Africa saw Kasande lose more than a hundred of his herd of 200 goats. Niliona amini adhiri zaidi. Mali unapata malisho niko inanda ikisha. Sasa kwa hivyo kame sasa vile simekufa amiatiri maisha ya nini? Ya mafamilia. In Oldonyiro location of Isiolo County, we meet Limba Lenakai, who has just moved to a new area in search of pasture for her livestock. Ile mbuzi nilikuwa nae mbele ya hii lali, nilikuwa miambili. Sasa kiangasi ikaingia, ika mbuzi miamoja ikakufa. When you have a place where you have drought on a regular basis, and you see people losing all their source of income, and becoming poor every day and every day. You cannot be just sitting and looking at it. You need to find a solution. Recognizing the need to strengthen the sustainability and quality of drought management in Kenya, in 2014, the Ministry of Agriculture, Livestock and Fisheries, with support from the International Livestock Research Institute, ILRI, and the World Bank, launched a livestock insurance scheme targeting vulnerable pastoralists. Having noticed the fact that um, challenges are facing the livestock sector um, in terms of drought or extreme weather conditions. And the strategy by government is how do we mitigate against that. So amongst other strategies which the government have put in place is the Kenya Livestock Insurance Program. The Kenya Livestock Insurance Program clip targets vulnerable pastoralists whose livelihoods are entirely dependent on livestock and who are at risk of going back into poverty when droughts strike and therefore susceptible to climate uncertainties and recurrent droughts. CLIP has been developed as a public-private partnership where the government provides the enabling conditions, including premium support, and the insurance companies develop and market the insurance products and pay claims to the insured beneficiaries. With the support of the other partners like INRI, World Bank, FST and so on, we have realized that we can make an enormous impact on uh, or, you know, through working together in the hope that we will be able to expand this uh, pr program through uh, all the counties. But at the same time, what we will also hope to do is that the awareness of insurance will, uh, will expand. CLIP is based on the internationally recognized index-based livestock insurance model, which was developed in 2009 by a team of scientists from ILRI and her technical partners. The signature feature of the novel insurance scheme is a use of satellite data to generate an index for grazing conditions so that payments are triggered when conditions fall below a certain critical level. Once the vegetation cover falls below a certain level, it shows that we need to now uh, pay out pastoralists so that they can uh, buy in whatever feeds they require to sustain their li uh, livestock. The index eliminates the need for insurance agents to be out in the field monitoring forage and animals which, given the remote regions involved, would make livestock insurance logistically and financially impossible to provide. The index-based system also ensures timely payouts to pastoralists, which helps herders keep more livestock alive.
haya tukakaa tu tukatukia tu siku moja simefika tunaitwa unasikia unaenda kupewa sheki hapo sasa ndio nimekuja kukubali hapa kumbe hii jwarasi ya livestock jwarasi iko ukweli by developing and delivering an appropriate livestock insurance product and ensuring that its provision is institutionalized at both county and national government levels livelihoods and incomes of vulnerable pastoralists will be improved we need to in, to invest in creation of awareness through the extension service which has now been devolved and also to ask the county governments that out of their budget let them supplement the government effort by also putting in budgets and increase the units which are being insured the government purchases insurance cover on behalf of the most vulnerable households who receive payouts when the satellite data indicate significant reduction in vegetation index clip leverages from kenya's acclaimed innovations in the financial sector the mpesa a mobile phone money transfer system or by using the network of agents developed by some banks in the northern kenya to primarily make the payments to affected poor households So far in this financial year 2016-2017 the government of Kenya through CLIP has issued over 534 million shillings an equivalent of 5.2 million US dollars to more than 23000 households or about 100000 people given the extended size of the households in six counties of Wajir, Turkana, Isiolo, Marsabit, Tana River and Mandera. Sasa serikali inatulipia kwa hiyo inchuara na nilipata 1200 nimenua na mbusi nimenua madawa ya mbusi Chula Denge from Sagante location in Marsabit knows livestock production as her only source of livelihood From her goats she gets milk to feed her children and can sell the surplus to enable her meet other needs Sawa ya dagae dagae na mwani wa ndasa akamale maache ndasa ina itidara itidaramena ya wargadde wana wargadde so ufin karkare oriki ya karkare maran karkare bisalin karkare yo bima ya klipi le tumepata nimejisaidia kununua maji nimenunua nyazi ndio sasa hata nime sustain hiyo mali yangu ngombe na inakaa afadhali na sija potesha hiyo ngombe yangu Initiatives such as CLIP provide a solution for vulnerable pastoralists by enabling them to protect their core breeding herd assets thereby building their resilience to drought. Drought and, and floods are happening all over the continent. And and this example is is already being followed by Ethiopia. And I know that some countries in the Sahel are very much interested in doing that again. So I can see this small example that where we have used innovation that we have in Kenya uh, through satellite to just make sure that we target the right people